Hey guys, how are y'all doing? I'm Pemby. This is uh, Unreal Engine 5, a little scene I put together. It's a rocky island with dinosaurs, of course. I've been doing that quite a lot lately. Velociraptors, Spinosaurus, Giganosaurus, and we have two Megalodons in the water. <coughs> now, what I've been experimenting with, as you can see here, is a little structure. What I've used is a concrete block, which you can basically, it's this thing here. I hate it when that happens. What it is, is a modular concrete median whatever that is. Right? So you get it from the from the Quicksil Bridge. You just go to window. Quicksil Bridge. And you basically search for that, okay? Running a bit slow because I'm recording. Actually, I've got it in my local. Yeah, it's a modular concrete medium. Now, I've got it downloaded high quality. Med it, it, it can be low quality because of its, the way I'm using it. So I don't know why I've got it at high quality, but that's just me being a bit naive. But anyway, just add that to your project. Look, modular concrete medium. Look for that. It can be anything really, it can be a piece of wood, anything you can mould and shape so it's nice and flat and it can be as long as you want, thick as you want, as wide as you want, you know what I mean? And what I've done here is you can, if I zoom in a little bit, it's made platform steps. That that diagonal piece is like a banister, same there. Yeah. So you start down there, as, as you can see I've not actually made all the steps yet. Need to uh, make me to duplicate that and put it here. Duplicate that, put it here, and another one there. Keep going up. As you can see, I've not done all of them yet. What the idea is, and I'll show you, is to climb this structure. But what I'm going to do is show you what it's cl what we're climbing. It's a watchtower. Now this I've downloaded, and. Um, I must put the link in the description to the creator because that's the, not the best thing to do, in it? I don't want to take no credit whatsoever for this uh, model. So the link will eventually be in the description to who made it. But uh, it's come in with its own collision, but it didn't work properly, you know? I couldn't interact with it at all. So I thought, how can I do this? I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm a total noob at this. But if you're an expert you probably tell me exactly how to make that interactable so you can run up the steps not fall off not go through any of the walls you know and basically interact with this object but for now this is one way i've found to do it so let's uh, let's test it out let's we can go up some of the steps and then we'll respawn inside here and i'll show you what i mean i'm going to put my mic down and uh, just show you You can see it fell through there because I, I didn't put the steps in place. Up top, I've done everything I need to do. Okay. Now as you can see, it still needs a bit of fine tuning because it, it, when the light shines in the right area, you will see that uh, you can still see parts of the concrete blocks that have embedded into the texture, into the model itself. But I'm not really bothered about that, but as you can see, it will not go through them walls. So you basically, it's like you're there. Now I've put one there, so it gives you a bit of a higher vantage point to observe the dinos as they're going about their daily life, you know, killing, maiming, eating, whatever else they do. <laughs> but before I had a problem, I thought, well, I can't just uh, put something down where it doesn't fall through the floor. It's got to make sure it doesn't fall through there either. So it's the same principle. See, as you can see it there, 
there. Now you can see that. That needs to be embedded into the texture a little bit, into the model a little bit more. But I'm not really bothered about that. This uh, And the same there, you can see how it's sticking out. So it's just a bit of fine tuning. But you can see I'm totally interacting with the building as though, you know. Now, what I'd like to know from you experts out there, obviously you probably got your head in your hands thinking, why is he doing this? Why is he doing this? But if it's new, it's a, if it's a new way, then I'm sure they'd like to know. If, you know, if you think it's a, a good way, it's very painstaking. If you've got a, a model with steps and you know a little doorway like that, but it's like a lot less comprehensive, it'll take you a lot less time. But just try it anyway. And uh, there's one one way of doing it. But if it, like if you add collision and you're a bit of an expert at this program then you'll probably be able to do it a lot simpler you know just by knowing what you're doing but right now i'm a total noob but i've come up with this method and uh, let me know what you think in the comments um i'm going to show you um some video i've made of this area and uh, i'm going to have a run around the, the landscape you can watch the dinosaurs at play as well as the megalodons swimming round in the ocean anyway let's let's finish with the, this bit with a nice cinematic look we can get the camera right bloody fiddly i've got to say there we go sun just over the horizon there anyway thank you uh thank you for watching and uh give me some advice and uh you know for now, this is all I know how to do things. I'm just a bit improvising. Okay, I'll catch you later, guys. Thanks for watching.